Hello everyone in Cyber World. Welcome back to another video. I'm Jennifer. And I'm Richard and this is our channel we call Poor Man's DIY. First I want to apologize about the noise. Um, we are living in a sub-association and they're doing some landscaping today. Yeah, it's kind of noisy so bear with us. Yes. Anyhow, today's project we're doing is something a little bit different from, from normal. It's not a woodworking thing. Um, our screen door and uh, gate that we're going to show you are um, in pretty bad shape so we're going to see what we can do to clean it up. Unfortunately you can't do a whole bunch to it because we have the rules of the association that we have to follow. So in essence what we're going to do is clean it up as best we can and uh, repaint it. Unfortunately uh, because how it's built uh, for security purposes we just can't take it off so we're going to have to do this all while it's mounted. Uh, let's get to work. Yes and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and leave us a comment. Okay, the, the uh, pressure washer we got off most of this, um, but there's still a lot of loose paint, so now we're going to use some sandpaper to take off everything else and smooth it out. Since everything is now clean, we're going to protect the walls with tape and plastic. We'll begin with a coat of primer. We then sprayed on a couple coats of flat enamel paint. So here is the final result of our screen door. This was actually an afterthought before we wanted to start with our front gate, which started peeling and getting rusted. And we found out why it peeled is because there was no primer put on the paint before we repainted. So what we did was we finished off with the gate, which looked beautiful. So we decided this was an afterthought and do this right here. Yeah, it actually turned out really well. Um, prior to this, we had a semi-gloss on it, but we selected a flat just to give us something a different, a different look to it, and it turned out really nice. We're really surprised uh, that it looked so well. Um, no regrets whatsoever. I think if I do any other metal painting uh, outside, I'll definitely go with the flat. It's a newer look, I believe, and uh, it's something that looks good for for our house. And as I said, we're very pleased with it. Next week's project, um, I've decided I'm getting too old to try and lift some heavy parts in my uh, workshop. And so I made a little something for my workbench so I don't have to lift this 80 pound device every single time. And I uh, will show you what I do for that. So until then, bye bye. bye.